and welcome back to my channel. So if you watched my last pregnancy update, you will know I have been doing a lot of shopping. So I thought I would just do a haul of all the bits I picked up. This was a bit of a splurge. Um, me and my friend went shopping. She is also pregnant. She's like three or four weeks behind me, um, also having a boy. So we went on a big kind of shopping day out in Leeds and it was really fun, really hot. I felt like I was about to drop dead, but we picked up loads and loads of goodies, so I thought I'd do you one big haul to show you what I picked up. So I will dive straight in and show you all the goodies. So the first shop I went to on our little shopping expedition was the White Company, or the Little White Company. I love the White Company, but it is not somewhere I shop regularly because it's really, really expensive. Um, I think everything I do is amazing quality, but because it's all quite plain and simple and basic, um, you feel that you're paying for the quality, but it doesn't necessarily look any more exciting than things do from other places that are cheaper. So yeah, I was very lucky that for my birthday, my dad actually got me a white company voucher. So I've been saving it for this shopping trip and I picked up a few goodies. I'll show you what I got. So the first thing I got, and this is definitely a splurge for what it is, but it's this gorgeous plain navy and white striped sleep suit. It's very like nautical. It's super, super soft. Um, it's 100% cotton. So like I said, you really do kind of pay for the quality from the white company. But when I tell you the price, seems a little bit steep for what it is. So full price, this was £22. Um, but they did have 20% off the day we went. So I got this for £17.60. Um, it is lovely quality and it's in a nice small size so he could wear this straight away. But I do think that's really, really steep for what it is. And if I didn't have a voucher, I probably would not. I mean, I definitely wouldn't have bought that for that price. Um, but with my voucher, I thought, let's treat this baby to a little bit of luxury and got him a really cute little stripy sleep suit. The second baby item I got from the White Company is quite possibly the most ridiculous baby purchase I've made because I don't know what not to three month old child needs a raincoat. He's not gonna be running around splashing in puddles at that age, but I could not resist when I saw this. It is so cute. And it is this navy little raincoat. Oh, isn't it adorable? I do love it, but again, totally silly purchase. Um, and it's got this like nautical navy and white stripe inside with like a red trim. And then on the cuffs of the sleeves, it's got like um, grey jersey. So it's really, really soft on their little squishy hands. Um, so yeah, I got him that in naught to three months. This was in the sale. So originally it was £38, which is very, very steep. But in the sale, this was £20.60. Um, again, if it hadn't have been a voucher, I wouldn't spend £20 on a raincoat for a three month old who really doesn't need a raincoat. But as it was with a voucher, I thought, why not? Because it is absolutely adorable. So that is his little raincoat. And the final thing I got from the White Company, um, this is not baby related, but I thought I would throw it in and show you. And it is a candle in the scent Seychelles. Oh, if you have not smelt this, you need to let me tell you you need this in your life this is without doubt the best smelling candle i have ever smelled it's just one of the kind of medium sized candles oh my god this literally is my new favorite smell i don't know if white company do perfume but if they do i would wear this i know they do room spray and i would wear that all over myself because this is without doubt my favorite 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 smell it's very summery. It is um, bergamot, amber and vanilla. It's heavenly, literally heavenly. So if you haven't tried any White Company candles, don't even smell this, just buy it. You can quote me on it. It is the best smell ever. But yes, I won't dwell on that too much as this is a baby haul and this candle is definitely not for baby, it's for me. Next up, I have some bits from Next next up from next that sounds weird um but i also had a next voucher i'd returned some things a while ago and couldn't see anything i wanted to buy at the time so i bought quite a few baby bits in next which i will show you now so the first thing i got from next is this super cute little outfit um it's hard to show you because it's attached but it is this little outfit so you get 
some light grey leggings with this like geometric triangle design on and they've got little turn ups at the bottom they are super cute right up my street and then you also get a matching jumper which is like in a navy it's kind of like a navy charcoal grey colour I can't decide which but it has a matching little like geometric triangle design so they're going to look really cute together but I also think you could mix and match them with like other leggings and other tops and things this is in three to six months so I tried to get a bit of a bigger size which is good for me because everything I buy is always teeny tiny because I like want to put him in it straight away um so yeah three to six months 13 pounds for that little outfit which I don't think is bad at all this is an absolutely ridiculous purchase, but it's possibly like the funniest, cutest little thing ever. And it's this little hat. I say little, it is huge. It's only three to six months, but it's like a proper slouchy, like hippie gnome elf hat. That's what I'm describing it as. And it is in like charcoal and cream stripe. It's got this like tassel detail at the top. I absolutely love that. I think he's gonna look ridiculous, but so cute. I actually think that would go really well with that little outfit. So yeah, three to six months for that. That was five pounds. Um, and my friend also got this for her baby so they can match and they will look completely ridiculous together. Next up from next is this like little four pack of like short rompers. I got these in three to six months, which probably wasn't sensible because they are the little short legged ones, which would be better in summer. But I don't know, but buying something that far ahead really scares me. So I just thought, get him in three to six months. And I figured he could wear them with like little leggings over them as like tops or if it's freakishly warm in like February, you never know with England. Um, so yeah, it's this four pack. They are again in three to six months, 18 pounds, which for four, I think is pretty good. And you get this like geometric blue one that says high on it. That's probably my favorite of the set. You get a mustardy one with like black stars on. I love this color. This is like my favorite, favorite color. You get this like stripy dinosaur one, which I think we all know is probably not my favourite because I'm not big into like stereotypically boyish prints, as I've said before, like cars and all that. If he likes that, that's fine, but I'm not going to force it on him, but um, it's all right. And the last one is this like orangey rust coloured one with a milk carton on, which I think is super cute. So yeah, got that four pack of like short rompers. Also from next, I got this three pack of leggings, which I really, really liked. I got these in, again, three to six months because I have so many baby leggings. As we know, I am a sucker for a baby legging and I've got tons in the smaller sizes. So I tried to get these in a slightly bigger size. The front pair is light gray with like geometric triangles. It's really similar to the one from that jumper legging set I've got, but it is slightly different. You also get a plain navy pair I'm not sure how well you can see these because they got a bit tangled but a plain navy pair that will just kind of go with any nice like printed top and finally you get this really sweet like monochrome black and white stripy pair which will just go with so much I've already got so yeah they were £10 for three pairs which I think is so good that's like what £3.33 per pair which I think is a total bargain so yeah three pairs for £10 from next in three to six months and the final thing from next is a really boring purchase but these are the kind of purchases I need to be making because I have loads of cute printed things but not a lot of boring practical. So I got a five pack of basic vests. These are the like short sleeve t-shirt vests um, in what size? Up to one month so they'll be good for when he's been just born. Plain white, 100% cotton. They feel really really soft and they were eight pounds. So yeah, not the most exciting purchase, but necessary, I think. We went into H&M, but I didn't actually find that much in the kids section I wanted to buy. I will just quickly show you this little pack of two bodysuits I got. If you watched my, I think it was my collective baby boy haul, I already had these in blue that my mum bought me. So you got a plain blue and a like blue and white stripey and they just feel so incredibly soft that when I saw this kind of green grey version I had to get them because they feel amazing. They're from the H&M Conscious Collection, 99% organic cotton and they are so so lovely and soft. I also really like the crossover front detail, I think these are the nicest bodysuits I've ever seen. Um, so yeah, you get a light grey in this pack and like a green and white stripe. So I absolutely love those. I got these in two to four months and they were $7.99 for the two. So yeah, they're the only thing I picked up in H&M, but I absolutely love them. And if you ever go in, have a feel of these because they are so soft. Can't wait to squeeze them in these. 
We also went into Primark and picked up quite a few basics. As I have mentioned previously, I'm not the biggest fan of Primark baby clothes. They're just not my style at all. Everything's kind of got like animals and like characters and like motifs and things on and that is just not my style at all for baby clothes. It's kind of very like traditional and it's just not what I like in baby clothes. But my friend really wanted to go in and we had a look and I picked up quite a few basics. So annoyingly, we went to Next before we went to Primark. And if we'd have gone to Primark first, I probably wouldn't have got those um, body suits because I picked up quite a few from Primark. They were much, much cheaper. And to be honest, the quality feels just as nice. Um, so I got three of the sleeveless body suits, which are like the more traditional vest style. Um, not three months, £2.30 for three. They literally might as well give them away. That is so cheap. Um, so yeah, they're just in the plain white in not three months. And then I also got in three to six months a pack of the three short sleeve bodysuits. So exactly the same style as the ones from Next. And again, three for £2.30, which is just crazy. I don't even want to know how they could afford to do them that cheap. But yeah, got those as well. And they feel really soft and really nice. Another pretty unexciting basic purchase from Primark was a three pack of white sleep suits. Um, these are in not to three months and they were £4.80. So again, such a bargain. And these are kind of like the full sleep suits with the feet. 100% um, cotton. I mean, when that white company one was like £20 for one 100% cotton sleep suit, and then you can get three for £4.80. That is just ridiculous. But um, I thought these would be really good because I have quite a lot of like patterned nice sleep suits and I'd want those more to be for like, you know, if we're like seeing people during the day and I want him to be comfy, but I want him still to look cute in his little outfit. That would probably be what I'd use those for. And these I think would be really great for just like genuine sleep suits just to like put him in on an evening so he's comfy and I don't think you can beat plain white it is really cute but yeah I got a pack of three in not three months for £4.80. When we'd been in the white company earlier that day I'd seen this really cute set that had like a little like cream hat with grey stars on and ears and it had matching little scratch mitts and it was so cute and such lovely quality it was really lovely quality but it was like £20 I think it was for literally a hat and like scratch mitts that they'd wear for pretty much no time I'm sure. Um, so I couldn't believe my luck when we were in Primark and I saw this and you get two hats, you get pretty much exactly the same one in like a whitey cream with grey stars with matching scratch mitts and then you also get a grey version again with matching scratch mitts. It's got ears and we all know I cannot resist anything with ears and this was £2.80. £2.80 compared to one for £20 from the white company. Um, again 100% cotton I think that is such a bargain the only issue is it's one size so I was kind of hoping this could be for like when he's first born and he's in hospital but it looks quite big to me I'm thinking maybe that's more like three to six months size not that I'm an expert I say this and he'll come out with a massive head um, but yeah, I thought that was an absolute bargain for £2.80. In the same range as that, I got a three pack of muslins. Um, muslins seem to be the kind of thing where everyone's like, you can never have enough muslins, buy all the muslins. And I really like them, like all the ones with cute prints on, I really like. Um, but I picked up this three pack from Primark for like a cheaper alternative. Again, 100% cotton. I have a pack very similar to this, but they're kind of plain stars. But these ones have little moons on as well, which I think is really cute. Um, and you get three for £3.30, so cannot go wrong. Picked up a pack of those. And the final thing I have from Primark is this little set. This was in the unisex section. It's completely unisex, but I just really, really liked it. Um, and it was an absolute bargain. This set was £6.50 and it's a four piece set. You get a little um, like body vest with long sleeves. That's white with moons and stars on. Um, you get a little stripy like bandana bib, a little hat. Now this sets in three to six months and the only thing I'm a bit confused about is that hat to me looks minute. That looks like a newborn hat, it's tiny. Um, so I don't think that would possibly fit him at three to six months, but whatever. Um, and then you get a plain 
grey and white stripy sleep suit with feet. It's really, really soft and just really simple. This totally reminds me of something you would get in the white company. And it's £6.50, so I couldn't resist that. My friend got it as well, so they can be matchy-matchy. And yeah, I just thought, what a bargain. And the final shop I've got bits to show you from is John Lewis. We've just recently um, got a John Lewis in Leeds in the new shopping centre. So we loved wandering around there. We were there for ages. It's huge. And it's got a whole floor dedicated to like babies and kids stuff and like toys, clothes feeding things, prams, it had it all, so we were there for ages. And that is actually where I made my first big baby purchase, um, which was a really big step for me. I told myself I wouldn't buy anything big um, until I got past 24 weeks, and I was like, 22 and a half weeks when we went shopping. So for me, that is a really big deal to have felt comfortable enough to make that big first purchase. So I was really pleased with that. I will save that till last to build up a little bit of suspense, but I will show you the other bits I got from John Lewis first. Um, grabbed one of their free baby magazines. So I'm looking forward to having a flick through this and probably want to buy everything that is probably way out of my budget. But yeah, looking forward to having a flick through that John Lewis baby magazine. I got this three pack of muslin cloths. These are the really big ones, I think. So you can use these as swaddles as well as muslins. Um, and I just love the prints on these. You get this gray one that's got like elephants and ducks and things on, which ordinarily would not be my thing at all. I'm not a big fan of like, animal prints unless it's like I love woodland animals but I'm not normally a fan of like generic babyish animal prints if that makes sense but this one for some reason I'm loving and I find it really really cute um you also get a plain black and white stripey one which again we all know I love monochrome so that will get lots of use and finally you get this white one with like multicolored like triangle sprinkles all over it so they are all really really cute these were 20 pounds but I'm pretty sure there was like 20% off those maybe. I'm pretty sure I didn't pay full price for those. I also found this little Christmas outfit in the sale. It was five pounds and I am a sucker for Christmas. I love Christmas, so I couldn't resist it. Um, it's just like a kind of light minty blue green colored sleep suit. And it's got like penguins, Christmas trees, foxes, seals. Don't know what that's about but not complaining it's really cute all over it um it's got a matching little knotted hat and we got this in naught to three months so it will fit him hopefully by christmas time um so yeah i really like that At full price it was 14 pounds and i got it for five in the sale and the last two clothing bits i got from john lewis are actually the same but in different colors and different sizes just because i loved them so much and the first one i got was this like mustard yellow cardigan with little pockets and buttons down it. I don't know if this is gonna do it justice on camera, but this is just the most lovely, cute little thing ever. I absolutely love it. Um, this color, like this like mustard yellow with gray and white for me is just like my absolute dream color combo. I think when we do his nursery, it will definitely be in that color scheme because I absolutely love it. Um, so yeah, we got this like mustard yellow one in naught to three months. Um, so this will fit him around Christmas time. He's gonna be an autumn winter baby. And this was 14 pounds. Um, one four I should point out not 40 not four zero one four um so not the cheapest but not horrendous I don't think um and it is just such lovely quality I absolutely love that so we got the mustard yellow in not three months and then after I'd seen that one I also saw it in the navy and I couldn't resist the navy either I just love this style of cardigan seems to be fluff attracting though um, but yeah, I couldn't resist that. So I got the navy in newborn. So that will fit him as soon as he's born, hopefully. Um, again, with the little pockets and the buttons. And it's just such a nice, like, chunky quality knit. I really, really like that. Um, again, that one was £14. And they were both from John Lewis. And finally, onto my big purchase from John Lewis. I don't actually know how I'm going to show you this. I might have to hold it up like a boombox. <laughs> but I invested in the sleepy head. Um, I looked at this for a long long time and I've always thought it's 135 pounds and I've always thought who would spend 135 pounds on a pillow 
but reading more and more reviews and the reviews are just insane i've not seen a single bad review everyone says it's the best thing they bought when they were expecting a baby um worth every penny and when i saw it i just thought Do you know what i'm gonna have it i'm getting it scrub it it's mine so i did and i bought it i got the gray and white chevron because i think that kind of goes more with our style um i think the plain white is 120 pounds and this one was 135 so it is 15 pounds more expensive but I just prefer the look of it and I justified it by thinking how practical is it in plain white when you're having a baby who sicks and poos all the time um so yeah I got the grey chevron 135 pounds my first big baby purchase and I just feel really proud of myself for like biting the bullet and getting it um it's really cute and I'm just happy I went for it so yeah I got that from John Lewis but I think you can also get it quite a few places online and I'm pretty sure I've seen them before in mother care as well so if you're considering it and you want someone to just tell you to do it just do it go for it I did and hopefully in however many months time we will discover that it was a very worthwhile investment I will report back on that one. So yeah, that was my last purchase for my big baby shopping trip in Leeds. You can expect more hauls to come because I have been buying a lot, but you know, got to enjoy it, don't you? Got to buy these things. So yeah, I will leave it there, guys. I will see you all in my next video and I hope you're all having a really good week. Bye, guys.